If there was a Mount Rushmore of YouTubers, which four people would you pick and why? Mount Rushmore, as in like, what you mean? Have, are you familiar with Mount Rushmore? It's a mountain, faces? a mountain with four U.S. presidents. Oh. And people have been making their own images where they're sticking heads of Wait, different- Wait, that's real? Well, the, pres the mountain of presidents, yes. Oh, all right, all right, so But like, people have been taking a picture of Mount Rushmore. And like remaking the faces? Yes, of all different right. topics. So some people have done like a Mount Rushmore of Atlanta rappers or Mount Rushmore of hip hop or whatever. But for you, my question to you is, what would be your Mount Rushmore of YouTubers? Which four people would you pick and why? Um, I pick, I'm gonna be a hundred. I'm gonna really be a hundred. Let, let me think. Um, I pick DDG. Fuck with his shit. He a real nigga, you feel me? That's like, you know how, like I just said, when you see a real nigga, you see a real nigga. He a real nigga. I, I put DDG on his jump as one. I put, I put KC3 stack, Kasanet, shout out them. So I'm saying, I put Kyle on that jump. I put me. Big Woo, you know what I'm saying? And I'll put, uh, who I'll put on that, John? I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna lie. I'll put, um, um, if you can't do four, that's okay too. I'll put Funny Mike on there. I fuck with Funny Mike, he, he a real nigga. Them some three real niggas that I, I watch here and there, because I don't watch YouTube all the time, but them some three real niggas that I put on that joint, because I fuck with how they carry themselves. I fuck with their content. Like, all them niggas got my respect. And why'd you put yourself on there? You didn't give a reason. Because I feel like I'm unique. I, I feel like, I honestly feel like, with that YouTube label, that YouTube stuff, it can go a long way for me because People are really invested into my life, and I feel like I got a good life. I feel like I got a good reason for people to watch me for me. You feel me? And it's not, it's not corny. I'm an inter I feel like I'm entertaining, because if I wasn't, I wouldn't be where I am today. So I feel like one day, excuse me, I feel like one day people gonna look at me as a big dog, as long as I stay humble though. I don't really look at myself as no big dog, no big nigga. I look at myself as a regular nigga like you. Like anybody in this world, everybody's just regular people to me. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like when you stay humble, more blessings come. That's why I don't, I'm never gonna be cocky, never gonna catch me being cocky. For transparency, do you know any of these other three personally? Actually, yeah. I know uh, Funny Mike. I, um, I talk to Funny Mike here and there. He a real good dude, real genuine guy. Kai. Don't know Kai. Don't know him. And DDG, I don't know him, but I I seen him before. Interacted. Mm -mm. Like saw him in passing? No, like I I just seen him on a like platforms. When it comes to funny Mike, have you actually met him physically or it's just been online? Digitally or phone call, FaceTime? Uh, to be honest, not yet. Like, I was supposed to go to, like, we were supposed to link. And I never did, because I, I, I had to go somewhere. But we re, like we rescheduling, so we're going to tap in. How did you two meet digitally, so to speak, for lack of a better phrase? Off Instagram. I, um, he followed me. He followed me. And I was like, like I wasn't hyped as hell as I probably would have been five years ago. But I was like, funny Mike? And I followed him back. And then we just interacted off of just, a, um, he showed love. Like, I think I showed love to his story. And then that's when we just started interacting. Like, I was like, this five. And I, we just started tapping in, type shit. 
on DMs. Yeah. And once again, for viewers watching this, getting to know you for the very first time, seeing this set of questions for the very first time between us, care to share your Instagram screen name? Uh, my Instagram is famous Wuda. F A M O U S W O O D A. And if DDG or Kai is watching this right now, anything you would say to any of them? Um, anything I say? Probably, I just say what's up, bro. Like it ain't, it ain't nothing to really say. I don't know them. I'm just saying like, no, nah, I can say keep doing y'all shit, but y'all already know that y'all been popping y'all shit. So I'm saying, but ain't nothing I can really say about them. But I really support them. Like they some, like they hard type shit. Follow up question on Mike. Anything else you want to mention about him or question you weren't asked? People want to know about him. I don't really want to speak too much, but I just want him to know I'm ready for what we setting up. Shit finna be fire. Shit finna be fire.